The following is a class on the Bhagavad Gita as it is, 16th chapter, text number 7, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on February 3rd, 1975 in Honolulu, Hawaii. Those who are in the mind do not know what is to be done and what is not to be done. Neither cleanliness nor proper behavior nor truth so, these are the symptoms of Asura. We have already discussed the characteristic of divine nature and the characteristic of demonic nature. Uh, in the Vishnu Puran, this is also confirmed. Go, Bhutasat, go, 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 There are two kinds of people all over the universe. There is Asura Loka and Deva Loka, planet. So, uh, the Vibhasura fight that is going on perpetually, the Vibhasura, demonic nature and divine nature. There are many people, they do not like us. Uh, because we are preaching God consciousness, this is our fault. Even in our own country, in India, the government do not like us. Because nowadays, everywhere practically, the demonic people being very much increased, the government is also demonic. So they do not like people in divine nature. They will uh, tolerate all kinds of noise, barking of the dog, motor car passing, the aeroplane on the But as soon as there is key gun, they are disturbed. They will tolerate so many different types of noise, but they will not tolerate, keep them. That is from the very beginning. In New York, when he started his movement, so in the morning at seven o'clock he used to hold our class, and there was little sound immediately, the tenants from upwards, they will come down complain. Sometimes they will call for police. And in the, on the street, Second Avenue, there is always big, big trucks and motor cars going on, heavy sound. Then in your country, the garbage carrier sound, the digging sound, so many sounds they tolerate. And as in Hare Krishna, uh, <laughs> this is demonic. This is demonic. Uh, they will not hear because that we do good to them by hearing. They will not accept. Uh, it is practically experience. Um, I know that the ghost, if you go, in a house, ghostly haunted, if you chant Hare Krishna mantra, they will go ahead. They cannot tolerate. In my life, several, there were several
several incidences like that in my you know, household life. I I was doing business in Lucknow, so there was our house, very big house, worth thousands of rupees rent, but it was mostly haunted. So and nobody would take that house. I took it at two hundred rupees. <laughs> and, very big house. And, and I was all the servants they complained, said they host. So I was chanting. He was living at several spots, especially on the gate side. So I could understand but I would chant Hare Krishna. And I was saved. Everyone was saved. And it's in nineteen hundred and sixty nine I was guest in the house of John Lennon in London. So there well, there was a ghost and it was a big plot. <laughs> There was a guest house. Uh, so they complained, Sir, here is cold. So I advised them to chant Hare Krishna. And the ghost went there. Yes. This is fact. When there is Hare Krishna chanting, this uh, ghostly, demonic living entities, they will not be able to stay there. They will go away. So, uh, two classes of men, uh, demonic and divine. So, divine nature has been explained in various ways from the very beginning. Uh, now Krishna is explaining about the uh, demonic nature. The first characteristic of demonic nature is <coughs> they do not know what should be the pravritti and what should be nirvitti. Uh, proper and improper action. 